Okay, we're back. Let's show you something about the X4 Pro most of you don't know. You think uh, the Solo Master Air Screw Props, no, they're too big. They won't fit. They go on a Solo. Okay, you're going to have to bear with me here. I don't have edits, so we're just going to land this little thing. See if I can get this camera where it's facing good. Turn this off. Turn off the solo. So what we've got here, and let's just go ahead and plug this up. And I've got a lot of dead weight. A lot of dead weight. No cameras working. Just got the gimbal up there for dead weight. Let's calibrate compass one. Go for two. Waiting at satellites. So, what I want to show you guys, Hubson standard prop, DGI size standard prop. This is uh, carbon fiber, master air screw, uh, 3DR solo prop. If you notice, not a lot of difference in the length of it, but if you notice, you've got more air management way more air management same with this these are the same okay also this prop here you got a lot of weight guess what's going to happen when you're descending coming down you're going to lose some air that's why these hubsons crash master air screw you're not going to lose too much air. It's not going to really give. Plus, the better air management, the uh, the better pitch. Okay. So right now we've got seven satellites on the Hubson. Let me get out of its way and listen to the uh, strain those uh, props put on. Sounds like a herd of bumblebees. Start the motors. You hear how they're struggling? Hear how much weight it is? hard to hold itself in position by the sounds of those props. They're struggling a bit. 
just to hold everything up. And a lot of people have their camera and they descend. See, if I don't know if you can see it, but it, it's kind of wobbling. And if you descend, see how that thing wobbles? Let's get it closer. Okay, let's go up. And you're not at 200 feet up, but if you can see it wobbling a little. See, those props are fighting to keep that up. I didn't come down, I went up and uh, left it. It's, I hope you could see that wobble there. This sounds like a herd of bumblebees right here. And it sucked my battery down. Plus these are uh, very old batteries. It struggled to get up and uh, enough uh, power to get going toward the top, you know, ascending. I get it right. So let's land. Okay, I didn't cut the motors yet. Let's see how this rises up. Come on. And if you can notice, it just wobbles. Okay, we cut the motors. Let's go put on the uh, master air screw props. Let's change this battery out. And let's see if you can see a difference. Just gonna have to bear through with me with this. I've put a string on this because it's swollen and it's up you know what to get out hey I should have had my other battery out but didn't Let's let it find GPS while I'm uh, changing the...
crops out. We'll remove these. Yeah, kind of boring. I know, should have cut this off, and but I don't have editing software, and I'm just not bothering with it. Plus, you can see I'm directly removing the master air screw prompts from the solo. They fit directly onto the hubsome. They're not wobbling. Well, that one wobbles a little, but that's okay. We've got clearance. Okay, can you see we've got clearance here? Turn it sideways, we've got clearance. Okay, so we've got clearance all over the place with these master air screws that fit the 3DR Solo. Let's take this over here. We've got satellites. And we don't have power. Calibrate compass. There you go. I knew that. Drone worshipping, but I just don't spin. Okay. We got 12 satellites. Hopefully you can see what the heck. Do those props sound a little bit stronger? Let me go back over and have a seat. I can just hear a definite difference in the uh, air management here. Let's come down. And it, it stops and just doesn't keep going down. It comes back up to where it should. We've got a breeze blowing here, so you're going to see a little bit of wobbling here. but.
I trust these master air screw props a lot more than I do the Hubson ones. And it does wobble, doesn't it? But given the, given the weight that's on here, got 12 satellites. This battery's running down. Batteries do good without anything on it, but with all this weight, like I said, this is just for demonstration. Letting Pat Soul, who has a so, uh, Hubson, Stuart Tiffany, UK sewing machines, uh, who has the uh, three uh, DJI Phantom, showing him how the solo props will work on his Phantom just fine. Uh, Drone Worship has the uh, smaller ones, but I personally like the ones that have the uh, little bit more air, air management space. go up you let go and it does stay there and hover it doesn't slide back down trying to find its place with these props and also one other thing once again does it sound like a herd of bumblebees See, that's what I'm trying to get across to a lot of people. We don't have the terrible air management and the herd of bumblebee sound with those prop, stock props trying to manage uh, the weight and keep this copter going. Okay, let's see if I can land this over here. Low battery is trying to land. And this is Sean Brooks. And with these master air screw props on the Hepson X4 Pro, I'm out of here.